Hey guys, Josh Dabington here, and if you can tell by the tone of my voice, this isn't a usual video that I make. And I've actually been debating if I should actually make this video actually happen because the stuff that's been going on with Activision behind the scenes is just, it's disgusting. Now that I actually feel like talking about it, let's discuss it, because more things happen, and the more I sit on it, the more and more things happen. Now, if you haven't already, make sure you drop a like, comment, and subscribe before we even get any further into the video. And uh, yeah, let's get right into it. Before, I, I don't even know what I'm gonna put on the screen. I just hope whatever gameplay I choose, y'all guys enjoy it, because I'm not hopping on Cold War no more, bro. Like, the game is dead. The game is not fun. And you can obviously see the game is dead by them always giving us double XP. Now, if you did know, you live under a rock. Uh, Activision Blizzard is getting sued by the state of California because of some workforce issues going on within the company. They're being, what's that, frat boy culture? Where employees are cube crawling and groping women and shit like that and doing a whole bunch of despicable shit, you know? There's women in the company that's getting less paid than their male counterparts. There was a female employee that went on a company trip and uh, she committed suicide because she kept, she was in a sexual relationship with a supervisor. And so after this happened, they started taking pictures of the deceased lady's vagina and shit like that. It's disgusting. It's all about this shit disgusting. If you haven't heard about the news that's going on with Activision, I advise y'all to go on Charlie Intel or one of those sites and read the shit. And this shit is just disgusting. And it's like, am I surprised? Are anybody in the, anybody watching this, are you surprised? They even said that the, the, the employees would come in hung over, play video games while everybody else went to work, like the developers. And it kind of makes me sad because it's like, you rag on Treyarch. Like, we, I rag on Treyarch. And I don't even do it being ass. I do it because I like how Black Ops 1, 2, and 3, and World at War, people love to forget about World at War. I love those games. I grew up playing those games. And I had fun with those games. And it's sad that Activision has pushed Treyarch to the point where they've lost like all type of inspiration with this game. There's no passion with Cold War or Black Ops 4 and both of those games, and it pains me to say it, both those games had potential, but they kept fucking it up and it wasn't even Treyarch's fault. It was really Activision, but it, it's just sad. Like, I, I don't get it. And then they had a walkout, which I fully support anybody, including Tony Flame that actually, um. Went out there and, and, and tweeted something about the walkout. That, that shit is tough. But this shit is disgusting. And I understand why people stop playing Call of Duty on Twitch and all that shit. Like, they just stop playing it. I don't, I don't blame you. And just stop supporting the game. I hope that this is a wake-up call and the investors see this shit. Because as of now, the stocks is plummeting. The sto Activision stocks is plummeting like hell. So, it's like, bro, I, I just hope the investors wake up. I hope everybody involved gets in trouble. I mean, fired and also arrested if you want to get uh, But come on, bro. It, this shit is disgusting. You can't have a business and then act like you're still in college. Like, my nigga, you graduated college. It's time to be an adult, man. You got to stop being a kid. Like, I get working at Activision and Blizzard is a dream job and shit like that. But you can't just be doing nasty shit like this. And I, I feel bad for the women out there. Like, the women that have to deal with shit like this in any workplace, that shit is sad. I feel like this is my philosophy. If you a woman, right, and you could do the same exact shit as a man, if better, then you should get paid the same. But unfortunately, we live in America, and that's just how shit is, you know? It, it, it's unfortunate, but you know what I'm saying? And I hope shit changes. I hope this changes the future of Activision. I hope this changes Blizzard's games. I hope this changes Call of Duty. I just hope that a whole bunch of shit just changes for Activision because this shit is, this is not good. And I hope Bobby Kotick, Damascus, whatever his name is, I hope his ass is kicked to the curb because letting this shit go on and y'all like, uh. Now, from my understanding, this lawsuit has been going on for a while now, but they just kept going under the hush. And then this time, it just gotten bigger to the point where it's like, yeah, we can't keep this shit under wraps no more. But it's just, I, I don't even have any words anymore. You know what I'm saying? This shit is crazy. And it's disgusting. 
Like, how you just gonna sit there and let this shit happen? Like, I, I don't get it. There's also a picture going around that there was also a suite that Blizzard employees had. It was called the Bill Cosby suite. And this shit happened back when uh Bill Cosby was going through his legal shit. Not the recent, but like the legal, legal shit with the whole sexual assault allegations and shit. So they had a room called the Cosby Suite and a whole bunch of men were just posted up, taking pictures and ah, yay. And that shit is just creepy. Like if you see the picture, that shit is sad. It is sad. And I hope someone is accountable for this shit. That's all I have to say on this topic. Like this shit is nasty. Um, to the women and anybody affected about this shit, my heart is with you. I think I'm gonna end the video there because I really don't have much to say. This shit is just disgusting. And like Activision is a despicable disgrace of a company. We already know this shit. I just hope shit changes. Activision used to be a good company. Fucking Tony Hawk, Rock Band. Well, no, not Rock Band. It was Tony Hawk and Guitar Hero and Call of Duty and some more shit, bro. I i holla at y'all later, man. Josh Davinson now. Make sure y'all sub and like and all that other shit. I'm out, man. Peace.